today we are going to learn a new topic large measures okay so look at the question what is the volume of a cube of size 1 meter what is the volume of a cube of size 1 meter okay so 1 meter is 100 centimeter okay 1 meter is 100 centimeter so we must calculate the volume of a cube of size 100 centimeter okay so what is the volume of a cube of size 1 meter so 1 meter is 100 centimeter so we must calculate the volume of a cube of size 100 centimeter so how much is it so we say that the volume of a cube of 1 meter is 1 cubic meter okay so 1 cubic meter is Okay, we say that the volume of cube 1 meter is 1 cubic meter. So, 1 cubic meter is equal to 10 lakh cubic centimeter. 10 lakh cubic centimeter. Okay. Okay. So, the volume of a cube of size of 1 meter, the volume of a cube of 1 meter is 1 cubic meter. So, 1 cubic meter is equal to 10 lakh cubic centimeter. Okay. So, volume of large objects are often said as 1 cubic meter. Okay. So, there is a question. The first question is, so we can solve the question using 1 cubic meter. Okay. So, volume of any large objects are often said as cubic meter. Look at the question. A track is loaded with sand 4 meter long, 2 meter wide and 1 meter high. Okay. A track is loaded with the sand with uh, 4 meter long and 2 meter wide and 1 meter height. And the price of 1 cubic meter of sand is given 1000 rupees. So, the question is what is the price of the track load? Okay. So, first we find the volume of the track. Okay. So, here the length and height and also y is given so using this we find volume which means 4 into 2 into 1 big a 8 cubic meter eight cubic meter and also the price of one cubic meter of sand is given price of one cubic meter of sand is given thousand rupees thousand rupees so the question is what is the price of this track load so the price of the track load is the price of the track load is we just multiply the volume and the price of 1 cubic meter. So, when we multiply the volume and 1 cubic meter of this, uh, the price of 1 cubic meter of sand, we get the price of the track load. Okay. So, here 8 into 1000. So, we get 8000 rupees. 8000 rupees is the price of the track load of this sand. Okay. So, and also there are two more questions. You, you just solve the question. Okay. So, another topic is capacity. Okay. So, next topic is capacity. The idea of volume is used to know the concept of capacity. The idea of volume is used to know the concept of capacity. So, capacity means the measure that contains the measure that contains inside the inside the tank, vessel, etc. Tank, vessel etc so a capacity means 
the measure that contains inside the tank vessel etc okay look at this hollow box it is made with thick wooden planks because of the thickness its inner length breadth and height are less than the outer measurements the inner length breadth and height are 40 cm 20 cm and 10 cm so a rectangular block of this measurement can exactly fit into the space within this box so the volume of this rectangle block is the volume within the box okay the volume of this rectangle block is the the volume of this rectangular block is the block is the volume within the box within the box okay so the volume of this rectangular block is the volume within the box okay the volume of this rectangular block is the volume within the box so this volume is called the capacity of the box this volume is called the this volume is called the capacity of the box capacity of the box okay so it's called the volume of this box is called capacity of the box okay so inner length is given so inner length is 40 centimeter and also breadth is given 20 centimeter and height is also given 10 centimeter so the capacity of the box is so the capacity of the box is 40 into the inner length into height into breadth okay 20 into 10 so we get 800 okay 800 cubic centimeter so the next question what is the capacity of a box whose inner length breadth and height is given 50 centimeter 25 centimeter and 20 centimeter so what is the uh, what is the capacity of a box okay so capacity of a box is Positive box is equal to the inner length into and breadth into height. Okay. So inner length is given one fifty and breadth is twenty five and height is twenty. So when we multiply this, we get. 25,000 cubic centimeter okay 25,000 cubic centimeter so this is the question related with capacity okay so for finding capacity we just multiply the inner length and breadth and height okay so in this topic we just learned uh, what, what is a 1 cubic meter so 1 cubic meter means 10 lakh cubic centimeter so uh, the volume of large measures can be said as 1 cubic meter and also the capacity what is the capacity okay the measures that contain inside the inside the tank vessel it's called capacity okay so today we learn what is the capacity and what is one cubic meter so, okay so there are the volume of large measures are often said as one cubic meter and uh, what is the capacity capacity means the measures that contain inside the vessel tank etc so for finding capacity to find the capacity we just multiply the inner line breadth and height okay so i hope all of you understand thank you